Hello everyone, you are in Endurance Laser Lab. In this video I am going to tell you how to install and run 10 watt plus endurance laser. So we have a laser that is installed here in aluminum housing and we have a heat sink inside. So this is cold part. This is hot part and between them you can find small plate. It is tech cooling. So this part remains cold, this part remains hot. So and the air blowing removes heat. So this is about the laser. This is a laser box. You have voltmeter and diameter that measures voltage and current that goes directly to a laser diode. You have a temperature sensor uh, and the probe is installed inside the heatsink. And you have two switches. One switch is uh, off and this switch is full power. And first switch is uh, TTL mode and this is Arduino mode. So uh, these are TTL wires that are usually connected to PWM and ground. To run the Arduino mode you have small hole here for mini USB and you just need to plug it here and we have a detailed video how to run an Arduino mode. You have a power jack here where you plug power and you have also power uh, power jack here so this is for your fans for both fans and for tech cooling let's talk about air assist so this is an air pump and we have uh, plastic tubes that go to an air nozzle let me show you an air nozzle so here is an air nozzle and you can actually adjust the height uh, and change uh, position of your nozzle to make sure that while laser is cutting the air goes directly to the place where the laser beam is being focused. In this model we added bigger focusing ring now you can adjust your focal range uh, screwing it in one or another direction without uh, a risk that you will be hit with a laser beam even on a low power so it's it's much easier to do right now. Endurance lasers have three holes on this side and one hole over there, M3, so it's quite easy now to hook and mount your laser to any 3D printer, CNC machine or XY plotter like this. The weight of this construction is about 400 or 500 grams, so it's closer to one pound, so it's not heavy at all. In our new model, a temperature probe is already installed inside the heatsink, so you can see real uh, laser temperature while it's working. So that was a quick intro, and now you'll see abilities of our 10 watt plus laser. Enjoy!